Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video we're gonna learn how to use Mesh Morpher and Blender. We're gonna load our mesh in Mesh Morpher. It's a MetaHuman. And now with version 1.7.5 we can export meshes to OBG files directly from Mesh Morpher. So we're going to Tools, Export Mesh export as obg export as obg watertight which is a welded mesh we're gonna use this welded mesh and save it it's gonna take a little bit okay it's done now we can go to blender blender we have to select the obg file obg file going to mesh more for tutorial and this is the obg file uh, the axis for our obg file uh, it's a uh, pretty standard uh, mesh morpher for obg export is using uh, x plus x positive x axis uh, as forward axis and y up and uh, for obg import it's using minus x for forward axis and z up so we're going to select here uh, minus x and the y up this is it import obg this is our meta human to make sure you imported the uh, correctly the mesh it has to face towards minus x you can see here in blender minus x and uh, yeah this is it now uh, we have to save uh, to export this obg again as an original obg because we need to have some standards to have some standards uh, between uh, base mesh and uh, morphed mesh, mesh when we import them back in uh, mesh morpher so we're gonna export it back and we are select here minus x forward and z up export as obg and since we did that here we can uh, modify a little bit we can modify a little bit the meta human here and we can go to sculpting we, we will select the mesh okay i'm not very efficient with the blender but i'm trying my best here let's do some inflate yeah and let's make uh, his uh, i don't know let's increase a little bit the brush size right, yeah right it'll work only with one side We're just using this shape for our tutorial so we can understand better what's going on yeah and this is it so now this is the morphed we, we created some changes to the mesh and we have a morphed uh, mesh so we have to export again we already have the settings here and we'll, we'll go with morphed export obg and uh, yeah uh, this is it going back to mesh morpher and now we can go to tools and create from obg files we will select the original obg as the base obg file and the morphed obg as the morphed obg file here we will leave axis y up unselected because we exported with axis z up and we're gonna uh, put uh, a name here horn for example and this is it
Ia spui tale talbet. We open horn. It's going on the left side, even though we created it on the uh, right side, as we're looking at it. So what's going on uh, here? Why why is this happening? It's uh, because we exported the mesh from Unreal from uh, the FBX file. Unreal uses left hand uh, uh, coordinate system, while we use right hand so to fix this let's uh, delete this uh, morph target to fix this problem one second let, let's uh, delete this create again uh, the morph target we already have the settings here but on scaling on x axis we will put minus one this will change our coordinate system it will mirror our mesh from uh, right to left horn let's go Let's open again the morph target and now it appears on the correct side as we created it here so this is it guys for uh, for this video i hope uh, i made uh, some things clear about uh, uh, mesh morpher and blender so don't forget uh, obg export from mesh morpher is x forward y up obg import is minus x forward and z up and uh yeah this is it see you around guys and uh don't forget to like this video bye